welcome back i haven't done a video in a minute maybe because i've had no time as you can tell i am in the house in the new house as you can continue to tell it is still a mess it is still a war zone we have scaffolds or i don't know how to say that that thingy majiggy everywhere the floors are still all over the place but on good news the floors upstairs are almost done almost done we're only missing the kids rooms so Kyrie's room and Kyle's room, which is what I will be working on today. And I'm so excited. So let me give you a quick little kind of walk around the upstairs because that's the area where I will be working today. And then, yeah. God, so this is pretty much what's going on upstairs. All the floors, or most of the floors, so my whole office is done. And look at how cute it looks. <laughs> um, I believe it still needs another coat of paint because my husband kind of put off put um close up all the holes and stuff so I, they're missing some cuts obviously all of the baseboards all of the crown moldings we're replacing all of the lights as you can see it's just a hole i'm not really sure what i'm gonna do with this window i'm thinking of buying from amazon those covers that are like um kind of holographic and when the sun hits it you kind of get like a nice little imagey thing -magey. i don't know I am not sure. But yeah, all of the floors, obviously they are extremely, extremely dirty. Because of course, none of the lights have covers. The downstairs is all a mess. <sighs> I'm not even gonna get in the downstairs. The master is all done. Except, you know, some of the cuts and again, the baseboards and the filling in places and you know crown molding and stuff like that they pretty much brought it all the way here we're still missing to do the master closet and then all of this the bathroom is just a pure pure mess they brought it in here again this is the little linen closet that is here and then it's pretty much all the way up to here we're still missing. Look at the difference. Like now it doesn't look like a Pepto Bismol room anymore. That pink is still extremely, extremely dark. And my husband might hate me, but I might just change it. I don't know if the lighting in here does it any justice, but there's a high, high, high possibility that my husband might hate me because I it, it's just too Pepto-ish for me. I don't know. We'll see. Her closet is painted, all the other walls are painted. I feel like they, every time he paints, somebody comes and messes it up. But whatevs. So yeah, they're still missing just to come in here and finish the floors. And today I'm going to be working in Kyle's room. As you can see, none of the floors in here have been done. All of the closet systems are in here. All of the mirrors, look at my fashion. Whoa. Wait, 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 we gotta do a, a little bop for this. This is what happens when you grow up with boys and all you wear are basketball shorts and just shirts. I would have worn a tank top, but I didn't feel like messing up my nice tank top, so I just brought this shirt. But yeah, basketball shorts covered in paint because that's what we do around here. And then some Skechers. Why Skechers? Because I wasn't gonna fuck up my nice shoes. Today, we are going to be working on this wall. Rahar, his accent wall and i am so excited i have the cutouts that i did i am beyond excited this is just to make my life a little easier and then i kind of freehand the graffiti bottle how cute is that i'm so excited but yeah i am excited to get started there's a shit ton of things that i kind of have to maneuver around but it is what it is Done. Now, the hubby's gonna paint, and then I got more to do. <laughs> Since, because I am crazy and I really don't like this Pepto Bismol bottle bullshit, we got paint. Oh my god, look at my hair! Ignore the hair. Hello, so it's day two. Yes, I'm wearing the same exact clothes because why am I going, you know, dirty someone else? So the hubby gave the wall a white kind of wash over all of the tape so that it wouldn't peel. But at the same time, once we peel off the tape, I kind of want the brick to actually look like brick. And you know how brick is kind of broken up into sections and pieces and all that shit. 
So we gonna work with that, okay? Have his name taped up here so that I can put it up on the wall. And I still have to, I'm probably just gonna hand paint the spray bottle onto the actual wall if I can find a pencil, cause mine broke. Um, and then go from there. Hey, de numero tres. Again, still rocking the same beautiful outfit. Chilling, sitting, waiting. We are currently trying to set up the chandelier. We are almost done with the upstairs. We are missing to do, to paint the new stripes on Kyrie's room and install the closets and then paint the master closet and then another coat of paint. Oh my God. And then another coat of paint in my office. And then all I gotta do is clean and we gotta take it off. I think all of the downstairs is painted. I will flip you guys around so you guys can see. Painted obviously the chandelier goes up there. That little spot up there doesn't matter because we're gonna put crown molding all through the top. That's why as you can see, like the edges who gives a hell about those is a bit covered. Everything's covered, everything's a mess. This is from the master bathroom. We were able to take it off. This is my chandelier, I'm so excited. Yeah. Everything is painted. And you can see the stripes in Kyrie's room. Alrighty. I don't even know what day we're on. I know there's clothes everywhere. So we've pretty much picked up all the mess. So I gotta take off that piece of tape. We Everything's painted officially. We're taking off all of the paper thingamajiggy and picking up all the dirt and garbage. We're still pending to install all of the lights on top. Still a mess everywhere. Hubby's taking off the paper. The kitchen still a mess. See, clothes are We haven't touched it, we haven't touched it. Ow! That is not nice. It's a mess. But what we have done is, so we used the scaffold and we installed our new chandelier. It's pretty. I was gonna get a more expensive one and they told me no. So we're gonna stick with that one. Um, all of this has been cleaned and swept up. There's still dust everywhere. My office is still pending the second coat, but I taped up the window today so that he can come in tomorrow and give it that second coat. This is still a mess, but I did pick it up and that's all the extra pieces of wood that I have to throw away. Taped up the master bathroom so that we can paint it. Nothing's been bought or put in here. The closet's been cleaned. He is planning to do a second coat of paint on that one. The kids' bathroom officially has been painted. It's still a mess, obviously. And the lights have been changed. Look at how cute. <gasps> And it goes perfect with their theme, which wasn't on purpose, by the way. I still have to clean the mirror. Yes, same outfit, like fifth day in a row. No, I think it's like four. I don't even know anymore. I've lost count, but yeah. <laughs> We're gonna replace the toilets and all of the shower thing jiggies. Eventually, this whole bathroom is getting gutted as well, including this, which is hideous, but that's a project for another day. Then, baby girl's room is missing a second coat of the white. And then obviously to remove the tape. And then we're pending to put up the closet, which is all here. But we need to put all of the baseboards and the crown molding before we can actually put up the closet and put back up the closet walls. And then baby boy's room is the one that's almost fully done. Look at how thinking cute that is ah, and they all turn on so i'm excited we have to put batteries but i haven't gotten around to that that is his closet <laughs> yeah mariquitas shout out to my cubans so <laughs> that's his closet that goes obviously inside the closet that is the gate for the upstairs the stairs so that no no accidents happen so but still we're missing all of the baseboards that's why his closet has not been installed and again all of the top, the crown molding, all of the pieces, I have to order them. Oh, it's not, there you go. All of those I have to order, that's all the hardware. That obviously, that goes downstairs, so that's once we're settled in. So that's one of the last things that's going downstairs. 
But yeah, I am obsessed with this wall. I'm gonna do some artwork up there as well. Um, it's gonna be all superhero. We have a frame that goes up there and we have another frame that goes up there. His K goes there that his grandfather made. He's gonna stick with that for life. His crib is gonna go here and the dresser is gonna go there. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna put anything in this wall. We'll get there once we get there. He does have a lot of shit, so. Their fans are all new and their highlights are all done as well. So pretty much the kids' ceilings are done, except well, we gotta cover that hole and that hole. But that's the fans and we have the vents, so that's... See, all of these have to be cheap. Look, so bright in here, I love it. The only thing I don't like is that the fan is yellow, but whatever. But yeah, that is pretty much all. I will be closing this video out on this note. And yeah, I'll update you guys on something else whenever we do something else, which will probably be tomorrow.